All right. Hi, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Geek Critique. Today, we will be ranking the most OP woman in honor of... Women's History Month. Women's, well, yeah, Women's History Month. Month. Yes. What do you mean? It's just... I was... No, like, it wasn't... Is this international or national? It's, it's Women's universal. Month. Universal. Because especially with the pack of women that we have in there, this is, this is interplanetary. Oh, yeah. This... Planetary? One of those words. We're making up words on the show, too. It's Women's History Month. Don't correct me. But we're here <laughs> with Quiva Morris, Maya oh. Brown. Hi. We are, have our lovely guests returning. They've already done an episode with us. How are we mm-hmm. feeling? You know. Feminine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Feminine. Beautiful. I see we, we get right skirts. into it. It feels yeah. like they're kind of right in the energy that they need to be in. Yeah, we're giving skirts today. So. Yes. Yes. I, I took a sure peek that. at this first one, and I'm excited. Are you? <laughs> um, before we start, are we locking in the ranking? No. No? Let them move it around. Fine. Next one, we're locking them in, though. Okay. That one, that's scary. Okay, ready? Go for it. I'm ready. Let's Woman start. number one. Okay. <gasps> my queen. Oh my god. <laughs> oh come on. My versatile right, queen. queen. Yeah, it's really funny because Jasmine <laughs> hates Shrek. I don't hate Shrek. I just don't have the blind obedience love that everyone else has. Like it's so just it's, it's a, a lifestyle. Lot. This it's is it's like, it. Do when you really don't like it, Shrek. I just don't <laughs> like it in the way that I'm sorry, we're getting off topic. We only have a few minutes. But like I just feel like the it's I think it's the crocs. Number one. <laughs> one. one. Number one. 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 Number one. <laughs> That woman, that bat. woman has layers. She tried yeah. to fight. Layers. She tried to fight me on her. Yeah, she All can right. fight. She's a princess. Well, she can blow up a bird with her song. God, who's yeah. Right? Who's number two? Yeah. Number Jeez, two. I see where this is going. I just got done watching Ted Nivison's video on watching every single Barbie movie, oh, mm-hmm. and it's like over an hour long, and I just watched all of it. So I'm in a Barbie mood. <laughs> how? How? Wait, Barbie instead of she said one. Yeah. yeah. How Barbie really? She said one. You know how many jobs she has? Well, I don't know what Quiva has to say, but I, I'm ready to go to bat for her. She can do everything. So I, she can do everything. And we she love women everything. in STEM. It's my favorite part. Uh-huh. But I also, uh, I, it's hard. I You know what? I'll go with it for now. And then we can move it around. One? I'll go with it for now. Yeah, I'll yeah. put out one as well. Fiona at two? Of the two of them I could go back and forth with yeah. for different reasons. Wow. All right, next one. All right, next. Let's do this thing. Here we go. We've got... Kiyoshi, oh. Avatar Kiyoshi. So I guess Y'all this pick really some good ones. Oh. This is oh, there's amazing. Oh, there's oh, amazing oh, ones. Oh, 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 but this really begs the question: How are you ranking these women? Yeah. Like, what is your barometer on OP? I almost want to base it off of like, okay, can we swear on here? Yeah, yeah like, please. Women that don't take shit from men. Okay, that's what I'm basing it off in my head. I love that. Okay, yeah. What was your in my mind? You? I'm thinking of like, like influence. You know, okay, like. That's valid. Um, what they have to like inspire others and how their being is just like badass, you know? I, mm-hmm. That's Kyoshi in a nutshell. Yeah. Yes. Uh, but that's also Barbie and Fiona. Yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah, Did Kyoshi also tell Aang to just kill Ozai? Yeah. But <laughs> yeah. I mean, you she did really say does. it's influence. How strong was her influence in that moment? Clearly so much so that she so yeah. much so she took over his body. Well, I mean, I feel like that's the ultimate influence. But. She also kind of was like, "Yeah, I killed that guy, but I kind of didn't, but I did." So, mm-hmm. <sighs> but she also changed I, the approach. You know what? To I Avatar almost started. actually would put Fiona at three and yes, her at two. I'm okay two. with that. I'm yeah. Okay with that. Now I'm okay that we're adding that. more to this, I feel like it would make sense. Okay. And the fact that she got her makeup to stay. Yeah. Yeah. That's influential. Influential. All right, next one. I don't oh, know this, uh, that's kind of valid. Oh, you don't She's know a character is? from no. Attack on you Titan. You guys picked really good ones. Like this you. is really um, hard. Just to give you a brief, uh, uh, what is the tallest building in the world that you could think of? Imagine that was a giant humanoid monster, mm-hmm. and you, a tiny individual, <laughs> had to take out that monster with just two swords mm-hmm. and a little f- and a little jet flying pack. device. Yeah. Yes, that is, and Mikasa is the best if not one of the best at doing that job she is a badass (sighs) okay i'm oh god this is (laughs) oh god this is a tough one okay i almost would move fiona down again let's go (laughs) i would put mikasa there because the like amount of mikasa (laughs) asukasa Like the amount of dynamics that she has to have mm-hmm. for like her to move around and the thing. dexterity, yeah the, yeah, the coordination and stuff to do that. And also, she works with a lot of like men mm-hmm. and still is like the most badass mm-hmm. and everything like that. And I love that about her. So yeah, I would move Fiona down and put her up yeah. there. Kyoshi, just... I still think is sick because she doesn't have to have swords in Can order you... to like kill right. someone. Period. Yeah, there we go. 
Mm-hmm. You got Fans yeah. on purpose. <laughs> the emotional right. strain, the making physical moves. strain. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. I do we're, Sorry. we're really, so nothing is down here yet. Because not yet. Because no, 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 like, all... just keeps moving down. Oh, <laughs> like... that's so crazy. Okay, next one, Sailor Moon. Oh. This woman can take out galaxies, bro. Yeah. I'm stronger than Goku. She's Sorry. really pretty and I like her hair. <laughs> okay, you like her meatballs. Okay, cool. Wait, huh? Those are the meatballs. She's meatball head. Where is she going? Well, no, I'm actually even more hungry than I was prior. <laughs> um, I don't. It she can seem take you guys out have galaxies, a but like I almost for this one want to be like women that I'm heavily passionate about. Mm-hmm. And it's like, yes, you can take out galaxies, but again, Kiyoshi can take out a bunch of people with just a fan. So okay. it's kind of like I'm. You just don't have a connection vibe. to this one. Yeah, I don't have like passion for her. Like these four, I have like passion. Um, Sailor Moon, I'm like. Barbie is a galactic god in one of her movies. Uh, like, <laughs> so I would just yeah. like to put that out there. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Like, so where are we putting five? Sweet little yeah, five. Oh, five? Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. I thought you, I thought so you were going to get down here. Oh, Love no, no, five. Yeah. I feel like we'll just keep moving it down. Yeah. We'll, have, oh, we'll give no. every woman their now chance. Now Sailor Moon is the one that's moving down. Yeah. yeah I keep, keep. Just bros being bros. All right, where are we at? All right, ready? <laughs> dudes. Just two bit. Oh, queen. Okay. Um, Taylor Swift. Now, <laughs> I'm, listen, listen, I am not a Swifty, okay? But However, I think that she is extremely influential. Yes. And mm-hmm. extremely inspiring. Yes. And um, has done a lot of good for this world and a lot yeah. of good for young girls. Yeah. So, Does I, she beat... Fiona. Yes. Okay. That's all I mm. needed to hear. I don't think Cleva agrees. Mm. Interesting. <laughs> Why? What I mean, you... like, put her in Mortal Kombat, though. Like, with, like, the <laughs> microphone and, like, like slam dunk on people, maybe. Mm, but, I like, you're, you're I, basing it off of who you're, like, really passionate about. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I do think she's a very influential person and everything. I almost agree putting her above Fiona because, again, she does slay. And also, um, we are That's making the barometer. Do yeah. they slay? <laughs> Do you slay? Would you though? say that her slay off? I'm also making. But does she slay? But yeah, does but she does slay? She, slay? Does she, slay? Um, she does. She's very influential. She's very uh, talented. So I almost would put her against Fiona. I also like think that it would be really awesome to see her in Mortal Kombat. So we're moving. <laughs> we're moving our four and five down. And yeah. Her yeah. In I think Fiona. Fiona's gonna keep moving down. Mm-hmm. Loki, and so yeah. just Wait. to be clear, Taylor Sorry. Swift is less than Barbie. Yes. yes. Taylor Swift is less than yes. Kiyoshi, yes. less than Mikasa. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now put Taylor in that blank space. <laughs> that was a good one. Oh, so if you if you haven't face. heard the um the version of Blank Space oh. by I Prevail, it's insane. It's, oh my gosh, it's yeah. fantastic. That's the first oh. version of Blank Space I ever heard, and I Period. couldn't go back from that. Okay. Anyway. All right, making moves. Pop goes punk. Um, oh my god. <laughs> Sue Sylvester. I saw it before you even showed it. Sue Sylvester. Wow, what a queen. I didn't what watch the slay. show. You didn't watch Glee? No. That's okay. It was a moment and it needed to. I know she wears lots of tracksuits. And I, yeah. I, I like, personally, I am like kind of anti tracksuit. Okay. Mm. So um, maybe she doesn't really slay. That's kind of, yeah. <laughs> slay oh. barometer. Put it here. Sue, non slay. Sue Sylvester would find all She's of those. Little insecurities, and just she would she wouldn't just antagonize them. She would drill into them to where you just why even exist? I, f- I feel like very she's like empowering. I feel like she's like the Thanos of Glee. Like she's very like <laughs> very like I will end yes. your entire bloodline. I mean, line. but she also had heart, and eventually you realize that in not in all cases. In fact, I'd say mm. only ten yeah. percent of the cases. What she did was to make you a better person. Yeah, and it she, she's a, you know she was there. She she was important for a reason. I love the actress. Um, not so much the character, but that's also because I think oh. I stopped watching Glee towards the end. That's mm-hmm. Sam Puckett's so, mom. Yes, it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so I. Bros being bros. Um, can you put it, maybe it at seven? Eight. At seven. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. For the first time, we're not moving it down. She's right. where she is. She is where she is. Yeah. Yeah. We have three more left. Yeah. And remember, you can move these around as they Yes, go. of course. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Beyonce. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's a sleigh. Yeah. <laughs> mm, the silence. Is this you <clears throat> mulling it over in your minds on where you'd place her? or? Yeah. Uh, I Unpopular Ooh. opinion. Okay. It's probably not. I'm like not like a big Beyonce girly. Not part of the beehive. Mm. I think that, you know, the she's, renaissance. No, I don't really care. I think she's very like 
influential, but mm. like respectfully, like she just doesn't like do it for me. Um, although I will be um, using her new country song in my <laughs> Powerpuff Cowgirl cosplay at WonderCon next Saturday, <laughs> uh, Sunday. Shout out. So mm, mm. there's that. I, I don't really care. We could put her. I would put her no. above Taylor Swift. I say this. <gasps> no. 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 Okay. Wait. No. Wait, 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 wait. All right. So we're gonna bring the Swifties place, and the Beyonce. I know. Okay. Both Yikes. of them are amazing. Both of them are amazing in different ways. The only reason I say Beyonce is because I feel like she represents more than just like you know hometown girl kind of vibe, like you know the age and stuff like that. I feel like she represents like. Sorry. You got something to say? <laughs> what are you? Just- you said her age. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, I mean, like, in the way of, like, like as in, like, she's, like, a lot of the fans that I see for Taylor Swift are people that are maybe, like, 20s, maybe younger, like, stuff like that, which is, like, valid. But Beyonce, I feel like, is, like, a very powerful black woman. Mm-hmm. So. I think. Sorry. Um, say what you got to say. I think Taylor Swift being so influential on the younger generation Mm -hmm. is honestly a little bit more, not saying that it's more important than Beyonce being a strong, powerful black woman in Mm. our society and being very slay. She's very slay. (laughs) She's very slay. (laughs) Because of course we love women. Taylor Swift being a positive role model for like young girls right now in a time where like there aren't a lot of positive like role models for, you know, sure. Like preteen girls, young girls Mm -hmm. that like need somebody to look up to. I think Taylor Swift is a really good person. So the question was, is Taylor Swift above Beyonce or not? It's a really hard one because I feel like both of them represent different things. I'm just very passionate, I think, on the idea that Beyonce is a very strong black woman and I admire that. Mm -hmm. So if it came down to me admiring one of them, it would be Beyonce because me as a black woman Mm. I would be like oh sick like I want to admire another black woman and stuff like that like in my head like and stuff but also again I appreciate the things about Taylor Swift too why don't we for now just because you've got two more left and for all we know I don't know where to put her uh, Yeah, we're gonna move these down (laughs) and we're gonna can I have Fiona and we'll put Beyonce (laughs) next to Taylor she's vibing for sure I love that song she did with Lady Gaga (laughs) (laughs) shut up Yes, we'll Hello. put them there, and then towards the end, you guys can duke it out yeah, if we have okay. time and switch okay. it. How's that? Is this okay for now? Yeah, yeah that's fine. That's right. right to me. Yeah. Wow. They're right beside oh. each other, so. <laughs> wow. Those were fighting words, but Indeed. anyway. Sandwich Next chest. one. <laughs> Boom. We've got, oh, Wonder Sorry. Woman. Sorry. Ooh, the silence. The silence. I know. What? <laughs> Yikes. What did Sorry. that mean? <laughs> Was it because we had the B and the um, Swifty beforehand, and now this is just one one? I just feel like there's just more people on the board that I'm passionate about. More than Wonder Woman? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I don't really... I, I just, don't know her too well. Not she's... Feeling the like, Amazon. again, I'm not basing it on, like, who would win in a fight. I'm sure. basing it on, like, just, like, oh, like, she's influential. All of these people up here are. Am I passionate about her? Would I see her as a role model for me? Fair enough. So, I'm... She does not slay. Yeah, she does not slay. She's so on the low end her, of the I feel like a lot of people How? are not going to be very happy with us. No, so sorry. You're, you're, you're getting some looks Fiona. from the side of the room right now. <laughs> These are so opinions. I'm so right now. Um, I almost, She's also mm. one of the first superhero women mm-hmm. introduced in Has the comic so book world. Has done so much for women right. in general. Continues to do so. But yeah, let's it's put also her below depend- uh, again, Fiona. It, <laughs> no, I think it, hey. it depends on Listen. what everyone's judging them on. I'm just saying. Like, well, I'm going based off like if you're going based off influential. I would probably put her before Fiona in front of all those other ones. Yeah, um, all the other ones. I'm so oh, sorry. Yeah. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Okay, we've got one oh, more Oh, wait, left. but do you agree with this placement? Yeah, I would, because I'm trying to look at it from, like, everyone's perspective of, like, okay, well, if we're talking about influential, this would be different, but if we're talking about just characters that I find inspiring to me, I mm. would put her, like, there, or, you know, I'm not going to say what I would say. That's but, okay. You know, That's okay. <laughs> okay. She got... would be somewhere else. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. <laughs> one more left. Last one is Wanda Maxima, the oh, Scarlet Witch. Slay. Slay. She slays. She has a lot of different outfits, which I feel like that's. <laughs> Yo, the Halloween fits like that's a wild. <laughs> well, she she has a lot of. Well, yeah, she does. Yeah, but how does she rank so does Barbie. amongst the other women? Oh yeah, Barbie does. I don't. I feel like in my mind, I'm kind of ranking it as like influence in a way. Sure. And I know that 
she's probably not as influential as mm-hmm. Wonder Woman. But she yeah. can influence your mind. Right. It's valid. But, right. Influence and, but also a lot of people like probably would say that like Wonder Woman is better than like Kyoshi. But yeah. that's not an opinion that I would raise. There are those people. There are absolutely those people. Yeah. You don't have to raise. You can just talk. No, it's okay. I just didn't <laughs> want to talk over anyone. Leave so up. I wanted to present that I <laughs> wish to talk. So, sure. Um, but I almost to your point, would put her, don't hate me, I would almost put her at the end because I feel like there's a lot of influence. I feel like there's a lot more influence. <laughs> you wanted a Fiona, you mean, what's your beef with Fiona? I, it's not my, I'm not on that side of the couch. It's Bro, fine. What is your beef with Fiona? Bro, it's it's every time you're just like, below, instead of Sue, you're like, below Fiona? <laughs> but I so you got a thing about there. green people. I, yeah. Hey. Hey, up. I didn't say it. Y'all heard it here first. <laughs> Jasmine It's the green people. Anti-green. So we're putting this one at 10. No. I, no. I, okay, After actually. Sue? No, actually, sorry. Yeah, I, Vivian was right here and I forgot Sue sorry. was present. So sorry, Sue. Can you move sorry, down, Queen? Sue. Thank what you. What about Sailor Moon? She's below Sailor Moon, I would below say. Below Sailor Moon? I would, personally, yeah. What? This is raw. Yeah. This is an unhinged list. This is interesting. Why? That's an adjective. Um, <laughs> That's I'm, an adjective. I'm gonna say something that Quiva's probably not gonna like here. It's okay. okay. I anyways. think. Aw, love you too. <laughs> Women. <laughs> Women in now, STEM. <laughs> yes. I think Taylor Swift should be second. Mm. Oh, so like moving everyone down? Yep. And keeping Beyonce where she is. I didn't say that exactly. I'm not sure. Oh. Okay. I'll let Quiva decide that because she seems to be very passionate. And who yeah. am I to tell another woman what's right or wrong? Thank you. Women in STEM. So I would say <laughs> I'll if we're going to make 30 her... seconds because we're running out of time. I'll give you 30 seconds. To I'll make say it really around. quickly. Um, and then if you want to slow it down in editing. So no, no. Taylor Swift, <laughs> move her to the second and then maybe Beyonce third. And then I'll be okay with that okay, option. Where are the other ones going? The yeah. other ones would just move down because I feel like these two, as long as they're uh, beside each other and have the like, you know, that vibe, then it would be fine. And we're okay. okay with Beyonce below Taylor. What if you just like smush Taylor and Beyonce yeah, together they so they're like hands. sharing they a spot? Cannot. They cannot. They can't hold hands? They cannot. Because there has to be a hierarchy. Why can't they hold well, hands? Well, that doesn't seem very like positive Womanly, girl boss energy not. to yeah. me. But it does seem very <laughs> geek critique. Yeah. So um, we have to find. Well, who makes the rules? A man? <laughs> <laughs> Can they, Jasmine? Just like the host me. sitting right so, here. So in your heart, <laughs> so in their heart, though, Taylor and Beyonce are, are meshed in two. Yeah. Can we get like yeah. little sticks so they can just actually to hold hands? Oh, um, they're like holding hands in my eyes. Alrighty. Wait, so like, this one. is yeah. we're happy with this list. <gasps> yes. This is your final ranking. Yes. Very cute. This yeah. is our final ranking. So oh, we have God. at number ten, Sue Sylvester. Number nine. Wanda Maximoff, number eight, Sailor Moon. Uh, number, uh, number, hey, 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 number seven, Fiona. Number yeah, seven, you Fiona. Number six, You saw what she Wonder did to Ariel Woman. that one scene. <laughs> <laughs> number five, Mikasa. Number four, Kiyoshi. Number three, oh Beyonce. God, like number wall. two, Taylor oh, Swift. And to reign supreme, Barbie. Barbie. Can I add in one more character um, just to wrap this up? Can sure. we add in Fiona's mom? Because she had oh a wall. Oh my god, Queen Lillian. Yeah, she really had a wall. And then realized there's another wall, she had that wall. And then realized there's another wall, head it again, so and then, then goes sits down. Taylor and Beyonce at two, Queen Lillian at Yeah, three. I almost would say she in front yeah. of Barbie because she had one in three you know, times. You added in moms? Jimmy Neutron's mom. Throw her on the yeah, board. Throw her in there. Board. Yeah. We'll, we'll have, have to save that for another ranking. Vivian, did we have a quick hairstyle? Game? Yeah, we need these. <laughs> so it's basically. It would be funny if it was just your phone. I'm going to hold up two images of the women we just ranked. Okay. And it sounds horrible. Of the women we just admired. Um, and you're just going to pick who would win. In a fight? Who would win? Who would win? Who would win? In a fight, in whatever your mind goes to. Who would win? How about in a fight? Okay, in yeah, a fight. Who, would win in a fight? who do you okay. think would win in the fight? Okay. Ready? And make it go by quicker. Okay. Mikasa Sailor versus Sailor Moon? Sailor Moon. Huh? Yeah. All right. Sorry. She okay. said she can control <laughs> galaxies. Wanda. <laughs> Wanda or Wanda. Sailor Moon? Yeah, Wanda. Wanda. Wanda, Wanda or Sue Wanda. Sylvester? <laughs> I don't know about that. She might kill her confidence, though. Kyoshi or Wanda? Yeah, Ooh. Wanda. Wanda? Uh, actually, Kyoshi might be really smart, though. Not might. She Kyoshi's will be that smart. Kyoshi's willing to murder. Yeah. Anyone. Ooh, but I feel like Wanda would mess with her reality, though, That's and valid. like bring up past trauma. Yeah. So but I mean, Kyoshi is a spiritual warrior, so. Oh, you're so valid. Oh, she can like bring on all the other avatars. She can. Mm-hmm. Kyoshi. 
All right. She got that. <laughs> Kiyoshi or Fiona? Kiyoshi. <laughs> really? There's yeah. only so much she can do, bruh. All right, Kiyoshi or Wonder Woman? Kiyoshi. One is a god and the other is a god? Kind of. Yeah, but like if I was like Wonder Woman and I heard those like avatar voices all at once and she has the white eyes, I'd be terrified. Mm. So I'm. So Kiyoshi? Kiyoshi to me, yeah. yeah. All right, Kiyoshi or Taylor Swift? (laughs) Taylor. Mortal Kombat. I think Kiyoshi reigns supreme here. Yeah, she does. Kiyoshi? Yeah. All right. And Kiyoshi or Beyonce? Must be so for real right now. She's, she's Kiyoshi. looking dead in the, in the eyes Love of the beehive right Kiyoshi now. Kiyoshi or Barbie? It depends now, on which Barbie. Remember, Barbie could be the avatar if she wanted Barbie. to. I remember she when I said, <laughs> you can be who you want to be, Barbie girl. Barbie can be anyone. Now, <laughs> Sorry. Kiyoshi Barbie versus Kiyoshi? <laughs> I told you that Barbie was like a, an... Um, a god? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like she was like a, oh, yeah. like a space god? Yeah. She also was a superhero at yeah. one point. Mm-hmm. She was a mermaid. And yeah. a ballerina multiple she times. She was a swan lake. So she was the picture, whole picture lake. Picture so. that those were her avatar <laughs> states. It's like okay, different yeah, lives. Yeah, yeah. So those are her oh, avatar she states. She can call on all of her yeah, past all lives. So Kiyoshi or Barbie. Over. Yeah, Barbie. She got so that. So once again, avatar state. Barbie reigns supreme. All righty, everyone. Thank you so much for being here at Geek Critique. Thank you, Maya. Thank you, Quiva. And of course, as always, thank you to my lovely host. Make sure you follow these two. Their handles are going to be right there at the bottom and we hope to see you guys again for the next ranking at Geek Critique. Bye. Bye.